Oh, Admiral Pierce. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, dude. Yo. All right, we are here today with another Elder God banger in Sea Salt. This is something I got my hands on, at least a demo of it. Early this year, late last year, I really enjoyed my time with it. Essentially, we are playing the roles of the villains in this game. We are the forces of Dagon, going up into the lands above and punishing the humans. If you guys have seen games like Right Click to Necromance, it's essentially the same thing. We're going to be controlling hordes of a lot of terrible creatures, and we will be doing a lot of terrible things to the humans up above. Let's get to it. Alright, so the first thing we'll be doing here is choosing which Apostle we shall be using in order to terrorize the humans up above. We have Agra de Pesca. It is said that he was once caught by a poor fisherman. It is said the man saw glory ooze from the eyes of Agra and released him back into the sea crying that such a beautiful fish is not meant to be eaten by a fool like me. Agra rose to the surface and granted the fisherman three wishes, thus creating the lineage of kings that still rule today. So right now, we have 25 of the, the most basic swarm right now. This will probably teach us how to play, so let's go over here and follow the arrow like the good boys that we are. Hold space to attack. We can get through. Our boys cannot. So this is something that the humans will be using as we progress towards the game. They're using barricades. I'm sure at some point they'll have their weapons as well. That's what we kind of have to do, use different type of units in order to have like a better chance of destroying them. But right now, they're barricading themselves in there, and unfortunately for them, they had no weapons, so we're really an escape plan in case we got through. While chasing enemies, surround them before pressing attack. Ah, okay. So let's get around. Get around, round, 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 and now we attack! Oh, ho, 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 ho. that is terrible. Uh, summon new minions at the summoning, summoning circle. Okay, who do we got here? We got the swarm, which is what we already have. The cultist. The worm. I like the idea of slowing enemies down. Sure, I'll pick up the worm. And there they are. Okay, so you can see them right there. Not as plentiful as our regular swarm, but hey, they're there. And they are leaving that little trickly ooze behind. Admiral Pierce, look here, men. I've got the gut feeling that something horrid this way comes. If you only knew. I will keep on the lookout for anything. Good. I spotted old steers in the waters over yonder, but our ship is unsinkable. Will we have Dagon on our side? Stop mocking about and get to work, boys. Dagon's on your side? I mean, I beg to differ. I think Dagon has um, other plans for you, my boy. So right now, what do we got? Kill all enemies in the room before advancing. Oh, you got it. Killing is kind of what we do best around here, isn't it? Is that a, uh... Oh my god, we destroyed that pick thing! Oh, what are you... Oh, oh, I see what we're doing. Boys, get through the barricade. This man over here does have range on him. Surround him. Kill him for even thinking about shooting his human tiny guns at us. And, oh, fire. If you don't hold attack, minions will avoid fire. Okay, good, good, good. So, for now, let's just go forward. We got plenty of go... Hey, excuse me! Again with the guns and the pew pew. When your gold meter is full, press B to summon extra minions. Oh, well, it is full right now. So, let's go ahead and uh, bring up the old beer here. The swarm, the worm... Can I bring the cultists out if I want to? Oh, I can't. Sweet! Alright, we have a hodgepodge of a lot of boys then. So, this is what's causing all the ruckus. I'll go down to my ship if I have to. I'm gonna boss fight. Admiral Pierce. Alright, Admiral Pierce. Swarm him, surround him, light that ass up. Over here, boys, surround. Oh my god, we're just, we're destroying this boy. Look at all the money he's dropped. Oh, we can summon more boys, hold on, hold on. Um, let me get, let me get a more slowdown thing. The worm. Okay, there's more gold to pick up here, by the way. Swarm. Oh, Admiral Pierce. Oh my god! Oh, dude! Yo! Yo, we tore this dude from every single limb. Head, legs, arm, everything was gone. Well, I guess you could say he uh, went down with his chip, because that chip's going down. <laughs> this is really cool. 
No, Dagon's forces are here. Collect everybody. This is uh, Baliev. Your Excellency, my apologies for interrupting, but we have had strange reports that the Admiral's flotilla has been sunk. Only a handful of survivors made it, and they tell tales of horrors that rose from the sea. This force, which we named Dagon, has beckoned us to sacrifice that which is impossible. Out there in the sea, where the horizon meets the skies, and we lose certainty of where the world ends, there rides a manifestation of our worst dreams. What are we to do? You must have knowledge of this. Has Dagon not asked for a sacrifice? Such is this unknown force that we have invited into our midst. Remorseless in its ability to slaughter us, and give us life with prosperity. So what I'm getting at is that they knowingly got in bed with Dagon, right? Because even Admiral Pierce was like, Oh, well, it's all fine. We got Dagon on our side. So something went amiss here. It is not... It is now beginning to crave more of us than that which we may give. Yeah, they've been they've been willingly sacrificing people all this time, though. Oh, ho, 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 ho. That's right, boys, flee. All right, let's see about smashing everything because I do like my fair bit of destruction as well. Where do you think that, Where do you think you're going, buddy? No, no, none of that. None of that running away stuff, right? Let's see. Some more fishermen over there. Oh my God! It left the baby. Oh, it left the. Hey, get over you freaking banditos! Oh, it actually blatted one of my worms from it. You saw that? He went skaplow. Yo, 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 hold up. Let's go back. Is the, the child still there? <gasps> oh! No, I, I look, look, I swear, I swear. You might think I pressed space to attack. I did not. I actually just went through it and they attacked it themselves. <laughs> I was going to leave it alone, to be honest, but you see what happened. I felt terrible. That's a terrible parent. Can you imagine? Can you imagine? I know you're being chased by some hideous monstrosities, but to just drop your son and be like, Yeah, well, that's too bad. That's terrible. <laughs> like, at least go down embracing your child, you know? You're gonna die, but you go down holding it. Did you just come at me with a butcher knife? I think you did. The ball's on... I think that was a lady. <laughs> she had a giant pair of testicles coming at me with a butcher's knife. Oh, 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 Malatops, watch it, boys. They're tossing the mollies now. Mmm, I, I guess, sure. Open this up in case we gotta, like, you know, chase somebody after them. Let's go back up now. Hello. Oh. Oh. <laughs> you guys just kill on your own, don't you? I know I had some humans up here, and I was like, let me just break this first, and I'm gonna go up there and kill them, and they were already gone, you see? That should clear me of the baby dead. The baby dead is not on me. Okay, you're over there, right? Le oh, hey, relax. I'm seeing if I'm trying to get around from you. We have another summoning circle here. I'm trying to see if I could go around those sh um, shooter dudes over there. Let's go and grab our slow boy. You know what? Let me get another cultist. Switch it up a little bit, you know? I'm liking the cultist a little bit. As long as we swarm with the little boys. Snipe away. Afterwards. We might be... Oh, pit die! Move, 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 move. Careful, careful with the Molly. No, we lost the summon. Uh, a cultist boy right now. Can you kill Molly boy? Molly boy's a pain in the ass, man. I gotta tell you. All right, there goes that guy. There goes that guy. We are almost ready for another summon. I guess we'll get the slow boys. They are do have a little bit of speed. You saw that guy? He tripped. <laughs> this dude over here, he just tripped. Terrible time to trip, my friend. Can I, by the way, move faster if I do the old shift? No. Oh, but I could look full. Oh, okay. If I hit shift, I could look forward. Oh, that's actually very... Not sure why the game didn't teach me about that. If you hold shift and, like, press the direction, you can look forward to see what's coming up. As opposed to just being, like, surprised by it. I mean, we could leave, but... I like how these guys have just been fishing the entire time. Like, you haven't heard the screams of pain and anguish of your fellow brethren out there. You guys were loaded with the gold, too. Apparently, you want to summon some boys, go after the fishermen. There's the one over here holding the, the filled up pockets. Let's go around three. No, no, don't attack him just yet. Swarm boys. 
Oh, ow! It's a fast suit. He doesn't have an HP bar. Oh, he, he wasn't a bus. More like a mini bus, maybe? We got a new card off of him. The crab. Sturdy melee minions with great defense but lacking attack. Resistant to fire. Well, I mean, that's going to be very good against the Molotov boys, I would say, huh? So he wasn't a boss, but he was more like a mini. Let's summon him. Let me get this crab, boy. Crab people, crab people, crab people. I'm going to say we get a bit more cultists with the next one. I did mention swarm. I did say that, but... Um, we're down to two cultists, and obviously a little bit of range is very useful. Oh, there's another one of these boys. All right. Yeah, so this is going to be kind of like a little champion enemy going forward for the most part. Summon now. Let me get... Ne next one. We'll, we'll, do, we'll do the swarm next one. Let me just get another cultist for now. All right. No, don't. Don't you run. Cultist got him. Good shot. All right. I wonder if there's like any like hidden stuff I should keep an eye out for. I'm trying to make sure that we cover all the groundwork to see if there's like a little alley somewhere, at least to more humans, but so far I think we've just about covered everything. This is a small little area too. Okay, there's our boss probably. The Wolf Master Glen. I'm not sure how crazy I am about this guy. Oh god, what is he doing? He's doing some sort of aim attack. Oh he he launches his freaking Oh, this is when you hit him. I see. That's the trick. Run, boys. Run. Run, 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 run. He can indeed break um, the crates as well. But that is definitely the trick. Okay. Move, 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 I'm glad we figured this out really quickly, because this could have otherwise been a problem had I just gone ahead and, like, you know, fought him like the last dude. Dare him to shreds, too. New card unlocked. What do we got this time? The Droga. Slow-moving minion with low attack spawns several smaller minions upon death. Not bad. Not bad. At least you go down, you spawn something in return for us. As a matter of fact. Let's, uh, bring that ass down right here. It's just one boy, though. It's just one boy. But once he goes down, I mean, what? I wonder what he spawns. Like, smaller versions of himself, just regular swarm boys. I'm curious about a victory. Arena unlocked. Karo Shaven Arena is now available. Find all arenas in the map. Man. Oh, we got, like, a Plague Doctor and everything. So these are probably the, the ultimate baddies that we're going to have to aim for towards the end. There is a force in the midst of our fate. Determined to destroy our way of life. It will take back all that we have worked for. All that we have sacrificed to obtain. We cannot crumble before the struggle. No, surely not, Your Excellency. We must fortify ourselves to the very last hunter. The vengeful, mindless minions will purge our common one to leave us in chaos. Of course, most venerable bishop. I shall pass the proper orders. We are being tested by the witch. That witch has fed us, given us strength, and has guided us. Protect the city at all costs. Alright. Well, we know what we're dealing with here for the future. Hmm. Got the Rodwood Swamps. So, I I'm curious as to... What would have happened had we gone north instead of going east? Got the burning tree over there too, which um, has its own symbolism in its own right. Well, there you guys have it. I hope you enjoyed it. If you'd like to see a bit more, let me know in the comments and by leaving a thumbs up. We can definitely come back for some more. Otherwise, all the information will be down below in the description in case you want to pick this up for yourselves. I will catch you next time.